All right, so like I told you guys on the phone call, I am running on a MacBook. So I just Google Discord, and this is the first link. You click, and then when I did this, I just downloaded for Mac OS, and that brought a little pop-up to my home screen. And then I was able to download the app. And once I get into the app, you have to obviously, you have to do your whole account setup and everything. You have to verify your email. But it'll open up. It'll it'll be fresh. But you'll have the stuff up here. And you can add friends. This is Sean's ID number. So that's going to be your first person you're going to want to add. And then he can put you into the Newman Media Chat if you haven't already. But just for functionality, these are called servers. And you can click on the server like this is Jake and I's. And the text channel is where you're just going to be able to come in and you're going to be able to just type in any message you want to. If you want to create more text channels, just go over to the text channels, go on to the plus, and you're going to select text channel, obviously. You're going to name it, and you're just going to create the channel. It'll just open up a brand new, fresh page. It won't look like all the stuff on here, like this is very busy right now. But if you want to do a voice channel, it's basically just opening up a call. So whoever's in this is going to be able to hear your voice and you're going to be able to hear theirs as long as this is enabled and you'll be able to hear them as long as this is enabled. So that's just muting yourself and that's muting the other person so you can't hear anything coming out. So I have the two voice channels. This is just the general and this is the podcast one and I clicked into it. So now if anybody else was in that, they would be able to be hearing me. But that's just the gist of Discord. If you have any other questions, I know Sean would be happy. And you can add Jake and I if you guys want any other help.